good, everybody? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Jump. Adrian Broner, no doubt, was considered one of the most talented boxers, pound for pound, in the sport. His own personal dilemmas and his own bad habits and undoing of himself calls for people not to take the brother serious. And of course, I believe his career is over. He might fight every now and then, but nobody expects him to be, you know, on the same level as, um, you know, Errol Spence or, or Terrence Crawford. Those days are gone. Adrian Broner spends his time pretty much being a shell fighter of himself and a troll online. So anyways, remember Glorilla put up there talking about the fact that, you know, all guys cheat. Adrian Broner says... He's fully committed and he never cheats. Glorilla says every jigger cheat, but I've been fully committed in my relationship and I've walked a straight line. She lying, bro, bro. <clears throat> Glorilla says my DM determined that was a lie. Then another young lady posts some actual receipts in which I won't post here because it's Adrian Broner. He was asking the girl to come over. The lady was saying stuff like, you know, hey, you're broke. Somebody said that you don't have no money anymore and all of this, okay? And I just want you guys to understand how people treat you when they feel like you're a loser. Now, if this was Floyd Mayweather, she wouldn't do that. It's Adrian Broner, who's a shell of himself. He's not serious. He still thinks that he's serious, but he's not. Even the IG models are refusing to come see him. They feel like he's a complete bum. I want guys to understand why it is so important to carry yourself with a level of dignity, carry yourself with a level of respect. And it's also important that you don't deal with these chicks, man. Um, first of all, you're in Glorilla's inbox and DMs. Can I ask why? I, 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 I just want to know why. What is it that you're going to get from Glorilla? Okay. And this is exactly why ladies are entitled, man, because brothers will be out here talking about F these chicks. These chicks ain't about nothing. These chicks terrible. <clears throat> and then the ones that are out here that brothers are saying is the most ratchet. What are brothers doing? They in the inbox. Brothers are in the DMs, the inbox. And it's not just Adrian Broner. It's a lot of brothers that do that. We're going to be real. Brothers that get on here. Oh, you know what? <clears throat> oh, you sipping. Man, you out here sipping, man. Ain't no way I'd do that. Man, that dude being there. Man, I just want you to come back. I'm sorry. Whatever you can do. Uh, look, I did it before. I've been there. I've done that. All right? Brothers need to stop lying. And the reality is, is that when ladies respect you, you know what I mean? Like, let me just tell you this. If you see a chick that's twerking and drunk all the time, you might think that she's good looking but you don't really respect her right the same thing with a guy out there acting a fool you know getting arrested being silly that's why you never see chicks you think that jay-z and these other guys like that even kevin hart i, I don't i mean you know those guys probably do their level of creeping it's not going to be exposed because of how those guys handle themselves okay how they handle themselves why is it a big, important thing for how you handle yourself? Because, man, what is the whole point of getting to the top? The top of the sport. You know, remember what uh, 50 Cent said. Damn, homie, in high school, you was the man, homie. What the F happened to you? Would you guys like to do that? Be at the top of something. For whatever reason, you're such a loser that you've actually experienced what it's like to be at the top of something. And then because of your own misgivings and your own mistake, your own mismanagement, people see you and they look down on you like, damn, what happened to this guy? He's not a guy that deserves any respect. So then those chicks start talking to you crazy, start treating you crazy. Because you're not serious. Adrian Broner is not acting like a man with his level of talent that should be getting respect. So guess what? He doesn't get it. You know what I mean? He doesn't get it. You have IG models out here talking to him crazy. Adrian Broner, a world-class fighter, now getting cooked by Instagram models, probably with her aunt. This is the guy who's at the top of the sport. 
just a few years ago. He could demand fights, but because he's out here acting like a goddamn buffoon, this is what we're get. This is what we're dealing with right now. This is what we are dealing with, and it don't make no kind of sense. How you carry yourself is is is, is very interesting, brothers. I want you black men to know that how you carry yourself is important. Don't let these chicks see you out here. Dusty. Okay. Out here ratchet. The brother was eating the box on the one of the things he did, man. Um, I don't know why he thought it was cool. He actually ate the box on camera inside of a car. <clears throat> it, it's almost like you seeing some chick getting her cheek clapped inside of a car. Would you respect that? Hell no, you wouldn't. No, nobody would respect that. Okay, somebody would think you're a complete loser if you were, and they would be right. They would be right. Nobody can respect that shit. All right, not at all. And so he calls it upon himself, man. Now even the struggle bunnies don't even want to deal with you, bro. Now also you're in these chicks' inbox out here acting like because you're trying to get Goldberg's attention. That's what it was. Glorilla really not give me no attention. So you're out here acting like, you know, I'm faithful to my chick trying to make her this insecurity. The girl don't want you. The girl don't want you because you're you, bro. A lot of a lot of guys feel like, you know, they're not you're not at the top of the world no more, bro. You're not Floyd Mayweather. You didn't save your money. You're not important. You see your value. You see guys that got the basically the game to be high in the game. And then you fall back down to earth. And you're not used to people treating you like that because all your friends gone. Nobody is kissing your ass anymore. You still think you're that guy. But you're not. These chicks don't respect you. These women do not respect you. When you are a person that is acting like a loser. You're not doing your thing. You're not taking care of shit. You're not on your business. All right, you're not serious. You're not none of that. You're a joke. Okay, you're a complete joke, and that is exactly what you are—a joke. Deal with it for what it is. Get yourself together, black men. All right, not saying all of y'all doing this, but look, don't 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 be something where you out here dusty letting these chicks do whatever. So, guys, we think it's your boy Shady Jackson. Back at it again. Flip sold off a slurpy drunk. Which is why you just heard a bell. We're out.